a lot of those assets are here in the U.S. in a in a yeah, standard. I'm not, I'm not even targeting Credit Suisse. I'm talking about Sw the Switzerland mm -hmm. banking sector. Mm -hmm. Why do people put money take take money out of their countries of origin and invest in Switzerland? In Switzerland, you mean actually in Switzerland as a country? Right. Well, I think historically, as we discussed, I think there has been. Uh, I think you know one of the things that's obviously highlighted is that there is an ability to you know shelter um, assets and income from paying taxes. Obviously, that is decreasingly the case, and clearly, you know, going forward, our view is that that's not the future of, of the industry. That's not – that's certainly not our business model. We don't think that should be any Swiss bank's business model. And clearly, with FATCA, with a number of the OECD arrangements are, that are taking place, and with, also with um, a number of other uh, developments, that's, that's not a uh, – you know, that's not an advantage that the Swiss banking system is going to have going forward. So it really has to be around – the ability to offer services and returns that are competitive and, in fact, um, superior to what they can see in other markets and other places where they can put their money. Okay. Well, again, I, I appreciate that, I think, forthright answer because I think it's important to get that yeah. basic, obvious right. uh, reality on the tables. We're talking about this because that's what all the secrecy is about. Right. That's what this, this whole thing's about. So I think from, from the U.S. perspective, we're just trying to make sure that Switzerland Understood. opens it up, makes it transparent so that U.S. taxpayers can shelter uh, income over there. If, if we want to invest in Switzerland because of great returns, we right. should have the right to do that, but we shouldn't have the right to, to shelter income. Understood, and we completely agree with that. We're completely okay. exactly in the same place on that. Well, thank you. Appreciate that. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Senator Johnson. Well, you may be in the same place, but the Swiss government surely is not, still has on the law that you cannot release the names of a account. Um, you cite that for not complying with a, a subpoena. So maybe your bank is in that position, maybe for future uh, deposits, but it sure as heck uh, does not reflect where the Swiss government is. And you, your bank is using the Swiss government's position in arguing against the enforcement of subpoenas. It says it puts you in a difficult position. But you come to this country 